a serious gamer. Hello everyone, this is Evans here bringing you the NGT 1 vs 2 Insane AI Challenge and uh, me playing as Terran and the uh, the only way you can really do this in some sort of reasonable time is to do a bunker rush. Now, compared to the cannon rush, the, uh, the, uh, the cannon rush for Protoss is much simpler and uh, there's really little uh, there's less hassle in dealing with unforeseen problems um, because you have to build two bunkers on two sides I mean photon cannons are easy enough I mean they're fully automated for crying out loud for bunkers you're gonna have to get soldiers and to do it in a reasonable amount of time you're gonna need two bunkers I mean you're gonna need two bunkers or three and at least two barracks and two supply depots um, all in all, it costs much more compared to the, um, in my opinion, it costs much more than doing a cannon setup. Um, so, it was kind of problematic at first. I was trying to narrow down to see if I could uh, get it going my way. But, um, I finally managed to do it. Um, it works well against Protoss and Terran setups, or Terran, Terran, Protoss, Protoss. Um, I get... Terran Terran again and um, it's easy enough to do uh, what you need to do is build bunk uh, build your uh, barracks or supply depot first um, I opt to build the barracks first and then build a supply depot after that you want to build bunkers um, right next to the mineral line or somewhere close where um, the Marines inside the bunkers can range it, um, it and then you gotta let nature take its course and then just basically keep churning out those marines hoping that with the pr uh, with the added pressure um, the uh, AI would surrender and it does take quite a bit of tries to get this to work um, it's very annoying to do it with Zerg um, cuz like the cannon setup um, you can't build the uh, the bunkers on the creep so that you gotta build the uh, bunkers pretty close to the spawning pool or the um, or the uh, roach den and uh, when you get one side to GG unload the uh, marines from that side to the side that hasn't surrendered yet and they should give up um, I really hate doing this particular um, sort of uh, cheese but um, cuz I'm not used to bunker rushing I'm used to just cannon rushing people because there's really little hassle um, when you uh, deal with this because um, um, cannons well after all your protoss everything builds for itself after you um, you you um, set the destination of where you want to build it so it's easier to do however Terran is a bit more complicated because of the fact that you know the buildings are pretty static um, I mean by uh, not static but basically bunkers are useless if there's nothing in them in, you got to turn out at least four marines for each bunker and um, it gets really annoying when uh, you want th them to come out faster but they're just not um, I probably could have built a reactor but um, you know it takes time to actually build that refinery um, and um, I don't think by the time you invest enough Vespian gas and got the reactors I don't think there would be enough um, there wouldn't be any uh, th sufficient time to finish this challenge fast enough. Um, I got this challenge at 4 minutes and 58 seconds. And that was really, really annoying. Um, the, the longest 4 minutes and 58 seconds of my life. Because um, because bunker rushing these guys is not foolproof. It doesn't guarantee you a surrender. Their workers might die, but that doesn't mean they're not having... Um, adequate enough resources to tech up to something else but their workers are dying so you know their um, income is uh, slowly dwindling and uh, it's about to be over soon and um, for some reason maybe building that third bunker scared the crap out of them I don't know but I do get the uh, AI to GG and uh, that's the that's the gist of it um, the whole thing is just keep conjuring those uh, not conjuring I keep saying that it's just not a magic game um, keep building those marines training those marines up and uh, eventually they'll give up so as you see got one side to quit 
uh, send my marines over to that side to uh, take care of what's left of the opponent. So like I said, I got 4 minutes and 58 seconds on this, so um, not necessarily the fastest time I've ever done with any sort of race, because, well, I've gotten better. But for Terran, it's definitely someone an accomplish uh, accomplishment, since a bunker rush was really designed to just kill one person and not two, because uh, um, it takes double the resources just to follow through. So I named it Kick Ass and Chewing Something Weird. Could have said Bubble Gum, but that would be kind of generic. And uh, thank you, NGT, for uh, having this contest. And I hope you guys enjoy this gameplay and commentary. This is Even Seer signing out. Peace.